Hi guys, Auntie Dana here. And I'm down by Kishana and I come to give her her donations. And as I promised, I'm gonna sit with that. And I have the police here. Um, they don't want to be in the camera. Officer, could you just say a word? Hi, I am here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and Kishana, don't bother with the crying. We are here for you. And yeah. Auntie Dana. Dana. <laughs> Who oh, you, oh, you say you don't want to leave you? And you just you were just crying, say Auntie Dana, don't leave me and come back, come spend time with me. And Auntie Dana cannot do that because she has other people who are on the program who she has to deal with, and yes. that's what I have to say. All right, so we're gonna have to do a Kishana. Before we go any further, I would love to apologize to you for making all this happen to you. Um, I did something this morning. That wasn't really right about somebody, something, and it had an argument which led Auntie Dana to be up here. Miss Anna, too, but overall, I'm very sorry for everything that has happened from the start. And I want to tell the public that Auntie Dana did not do anything to me. All she did was care for me, love me. She took me up, she gave me anything, she showed me a mother love. She did not accuse me. She was not. La Everything that she said was true. I didn't. I don't want nobody to feel like Aunt Dana is doing anything because she's very nice to me and I love her. I love her so much. She treat me better than how my mother and father treat me. And I just want her to know that I'm very sorry for all the wrongs that I've done. And if I'm going to do something, I will ask her first. No, no. You are a big woman. You don't have to ask her. You don't have to ask her. You have to be truthful. Okay. Just be truthful to her and tell her the truth more than lying. So I don't want anyone to feel like Auntie Donna is doing anything bad. She's very loving and caring for me. And you must also remember that other people are on the program and Auntie Donna cannot spend the day with you up here. That is what you are requesting now. And it is very impossible. Okay, yeah, so, so I also remember that. You yeah, okay. Alright, so Kishana. Um me I'm a very thick skin. Crocodile skin me yeah. What people say about me do not deter me, it only makes me stronger. And growing up, I have been through a lot with people and if me did follow people and my granny would have said, if me follow yeah, I'm not a fish. So People say a lot, people gonna do a lot, even, even from this day on, people are gonna still say stuff. And I acknowledge that you came and you apologized. Nobody put you up to do this, nobody put you up. Um, this morning incident, and if I, I'm an open person, right? And what took place, it might go on social media, it might not. But persons know about it. And I have to speak justice, and I'm an open person. What you did to the, the tenants right here, was outright wrong. You are new to the place. I won't say what it is on video. You are new to the place and you don't know her. She don't know you. And what you did was wrong. And I told her that and I apologize to her because she came to my house 6 o'clock this morning when I wake up and go back to sleep. And I came here and I passed the fight and she's still upset but she said you came and you apologized. I'm going to teach you something as a young girl. I wouldn't classify this as a big tenant. It's a big house. And everybody has their own quarters. Right here. And um, persons rent you the place on behalf of me. And what transpired if the landlord hear this? The landlord didn't want to come and tell me to find. He's going to hear because he's here already. He was planning to come and tell me to find somewhere and put you. And I am only telling you on camera for the persons in the community that know because there was an uproar here this morning. To know that Auntie Dana is not um, taking sides with anyone. I told Kishana she was wrong. I apologize to the lady. And one thing I'm going to tell you, Kishana, you seem in the videos to me as a very humble, shy person. But I don't know if it's the camera why you act that way. And I want you to let them know that you are not a shy person as everybody ought to see you to be. You are a different person off camera. And I accept that. I'm going to move on from this. So if that story what happened was supposed to go in the media and people running with it, I can say I came on here and I 
you discuss that you are sorry for what you have done to the lady and I apologize. And in the future, man has carried you along with me. So end of that. Anything else you want to say? I just want the the uh, the thing everything that is going on to finish because Auntie Dana has been very nice to me, very caring. And um I don't want everyone going down on her and telling her bad things and stuff because if it was for her I was still living in the condition that no one's supposed to be living with two babies in. And so <coughs> I just want everyone to leave it at that and just move on with their lives and don't accuse Auntie Dana because she is very nice to me. Okay and Kishana before I go with this video when I came to you the first day before you, I was beginning. What did I tell you about this? Program? Did I explain to you and tell you that this is an open and transparent program and that anything that is happening in and around the program, it will come on social media? I told you about YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and any other media. Did I not explain that to you? Yes. And what did you say? Okay. And um, the reason why I, I, I put out what was happening with Kishan at that day, I was very upset and I felt betrayed. I felt belittled and I felt lied to. As I was saying, you know, I put a lot of persons on hold to come and assist you to do, um, help you to get the house to get you on your feet. And then you, know, you told me that you didn't have any boyfriend, any baby father, the only the boyfriend that you had was the rest of the man. And that, you know, you, you want me to help you to get back on your feet. And when I come and I saw what was taking place, taking place, and then you began to lie to me. I felt like I said, I can't bother with this girl no more. You know, because you don't need to lie to me. And I said, because of what was happening, persons in and around the community knew. And they're going to talk because they don't own anything here. And nobody did not send call me this Sunday when I came. I was just cooking. The lady brought the butter at the Sunday because you... So you tell me that the baby fall off the bed? Yes. And I was bringing dinner for you because I cook the big tail. And I said, all right. I'm going to go back to and get some of the good, good big tail when I cook. Yeah. Take up the, 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 the Claudia Garner and I said to my neighbor, I said, come carry me up there with the, the, the bus on it now. And he said, okay, I'm going to ask somebody to walk with me and bring it and pay them a thousand dollars to bring it. And I never know that nothing was here. Nobody never called me. Even the appalling in the night when I'm coming out, one of the neighbors said to me, I said, boy, Miss Anna, we don't want to tell you a long time, so Frankie Shana come and be a people, I come my place, and you know, be a nice and people are come and go and move on. The thing then, can you give people stuff for people here? My friend, people, can you give them a bag? No, I did not give anyone any bag. Oh, like your family, you give them nothing? No, I, when my sister came and my son... Oh, we might be at them, they might have, they don't know No, they never left with anything. Okay. Well, that is what they said. So, and you know, people will talk things with us, so, and part talk things and go, so why I'm doing this video? I you start talk, that Instagram person who don't see me on the live, I hardly go on the live on Instagram, can hear the, the story. And I, I felt my heart race, and I don't know why I always get emotional with person get too attached. As my daughter said, Mommy, when you help people, you can't attach to them and open at them, you don't know them, they must change. But it's just me. I have a very forgiving heart. And um, what did what you read? Almost nine. When it is nine thirty, second so just that. So Kishana, I had to share it and I said I'm going to talk my truth and if my truth offends Kishana and if my truth offends anyone, I cannot do anything about it. I'm just speaking the truth and this is how 